What's up everybody, this is Tadpole Superhero, and today we're playing some Mega Man X. We're going to finish getting all the upgrades because I was really terrible at playing video games last time. So we're heading into Launch Octopus's stage because I forgot stuff last time I played. Uh, I forgot that you could... I forgot that you can ride the Cyclones. Uh, I erroneously said that... Wow, this is really bad. I'm, I'm doing it all over again, guys. I'm so sorry. I erroneously said that the cyclone, the water cyclones would hurt you. That's not true. You actually need to ride them, and you can go up to some ships up on top of the water and, and hang out with them. So actually, I'm going to switch to my screen clearing extraordinaire, the Storm Tornado. Love this weapon against against regular enemies. Against mini bosses is pretty sweet too. Alright, uh yes, mini boss time. And I might I might do some fast forwarding through some of this stuff. Uh cause, you know, there's a lot happening. And you've seen you've seen a lot of this before, so I might fast forward through some of the levels or through some of the stuff I do in some of the levels. I don't know. We'll see. Did I get him yet? Huh? For some reason, I thought the storm tornado was more powerful. You can give me some cool stuff. Got me some health. Thanks, buddy. Oh, and then we have the much more annoying version. Alright, uh, and he is right here. You have to really be on your toes with this one. Why am I not shooting? I'm... Oh, I'm out of ammo! Ha! <laughs> that, 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 yeah, that's, that's a problem. Okay, um, I'll just go back to my X-Buster then. No! Oh my gosh. Yeah, I am gonna fa I'll fast forward here and there. Uh, maybe just cut stuff out entirely at points. We'll see. Alright, we're right in front of- yeah, so there's not really anything to cut out. Whoa! How did I- how did I not get hit by the spikes there? I do not even know. You'd think a short hop would be the way to go with those. Alright, there we go. Oh, I'd really like health. Okay, so I should be able to ride this. Yeah! No! Alright, I think I know. Or actually, I think there's one that's higher up. Ah! Uh. Alright. Come on, Cyclone. Typhoon, whatever you want to call yourself. Where is it? How do I get up there? How do I get up there? There we go. Is there anything up here? There is an upgrade somewhere in here. It's not it's not on this side, it might be on the other side. I am gonna try the other side. It just takes a little finessing, which I'm not good at the whole finessing jumps. But hey, there's a first time for everything! Ah! Alright. Come back. Come back, please. Uh, and this is not the only area where I'm going to need to do this. There we go. Okay, there's nothing on this side. Okay. I could have already seen that, but I didn't want to see it. Yes, I want to go over here. No! Oh my gosh. I'm so bad at this. Alright. Come on, Cyclone. Yeah, these guys will go down with a charge shot here and a charge shot there. Can I destroy this? 
Yes, I should be able to. Maybe it's flashing, which should indicate that I'm doing damage to it. Yes! Haha! <laughs> Sink the ship. Alright. Anything in it? Oh, jeez. Oh, gorsh. Whoa, where are we going? Whoa! Alright. That was cool. I may not have actually gotten this upgrade on my first run through because I don't remember this. Oh! Hello! So this guy just takes some effort, this little eel. Kind of reminds me of the eel in Mario 64, only not really. But he kind of does, but not really. But he could if he was if he was trying. <laughs> oh, I do not remember doing this. I may not have done this in my first playthrough. Hmm, interesting. Anyway, this guy is is kind of an annoying mini boss just because he just he just takes a long time. He's not hard. He's not difficult. He's just time consuming. He just runs back and forth like like a silly a silly Gyarados. That's what I'm gonna call him. He's a silly Gyarados. I don't know why it's a Gyarados, but hey. I mean he can be whatever he wants to be. Except for Mega Man, because there's only there can be only one. Okay, cool. So what's in here? Oh a heart tank! How about that? I was looking for those. Alright, uh, I think I can leave. I'm gonna double check though. I'm gonna check and make sure that there's not another ship I can blow up. Because if I could destroy more more ships, that would be really fun. I think this is the one I rode up to that one? Yeah, probably. Okay. Any more cyclones? Nope. Alright. Can I, can I exit? Sweet! Alright. Now, we are going to go to... Where did I say before I started recording where, where I was going to go? Yes, we're going to go to Spark Mandrill and we're going to... I have a theory about that uh, heart tank near the end. Uh, so, yeah, I'm going to figure that one out. Oh, wow, I defeated him before he could even fire a shot. That doesn't happen very often. I remember this was these these uh, robot cannon missile launcher dudes were the first ones where I really figured out their attack pattern and I just it felt so cool and that's one of the things I love about this game is you just feel so accomplished for like everything that you do uh, so you figure out you know you figure out an enemy's attack pattern or you figure out a boss's attack pattern It just feels really cool. Yeah, I'm starting to. I learned to anticipate those uh, laser birds or whatever they are. The ones that fly right across the screen. Oh, we've got my nemesis. Which is actually not that hard when you have the storm tornado. And when you've played this game more than once. Take that. Hey, don't fly away when I'm shooting at you. There we go. Look at that. No damage. Oh, wait. I'm just going to stick with the storm tornado. So that thing does damage. Oh, this music just, just rocks so much. Ah! Wheelie... He reminds me of the uh, the wheelie power up in Kirby Triple Deluxe. That is such a such an OP power up, but it's awesome and I love it. I need ammo. Go away, wheelie! Ha ha! 
and then take your tornado medicine. Tornado medicine. It's the it's the next big thing. I forget Samsung. This is the next big thing. Tornado tornado meds. That makes so much sense. Uh, I'm not anticipating these birds though. No, stop it, laser bird. Kind of like look like a boomerang. Nope. 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 I also figured out how to get that guy without using the... It's not this stage? Wait a minute. I was sure it was this stage. Did I just like completely ignore it? I think I did. I think I know exactly where it is too. So we're gonna go get it. I'm sure there's a heart tank in here. I'm pretty sure this was the level and I'm pretty sure it's right up here. Yeah, okay. So I had a theory. Oh no, my theory is broken. How do I shoot them up? How do I control whether they go up or down? So now it's going up. If I jump, it goes down. Okay, see, how do I do that? What? I got one going up. Oh, it's not even going to reach it. Okay. Then I know what I need to do, uh, and I can't do that right now. So we're going to leave. Next up is Boomer Quanger stage. There's another heart tank here, which, you, which I know you can get with the boomerang cutter. So that's next. Let's switch to the... Uh, Horming torpedoes. Yes. The Horming torpedoes. It's quite the uh, the rare the rare combat implement. Actually the homing torpedo doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. Oh it can one shot those guys. Okay, never mind. It makes total sense. What am I doing? <laughs> No. Uh wait. Um Yeah, let's just let's just let's just go through the level. I need to stop trying to be tricksy cuz I'm not good at the tricksy business. Oh, hey. Thanks for the health, bro. These guys are so annoying. No! Haha, <laughs> you missed. Mwahaha. <laughs> okay, now we use the storm tornado. Which I keep passing through. I actually, I'm going to show you guys a little secret that I did. Um, you can actually change your controller settings. And since I've been playing Mega Man ZX, I was like, you know what? Let's make the L button the dash button. So, little secret. If you want to call foul, go for it. I, w I would understand. <laughs> it just feels right having a shoulder button as your dash. Anyway, if you guys cry foul and say that I should never even consider doing this ever again, then I won't. I'll I'll just stop with the shenanigans. No! Oh, you, sa you saved me from spikes. So, I guess I should be grateful. <laughs> it's like Star Fox 64, Falco. I guess I should be grateful. Yeah. Alright, anyway. Let's go! Let's climb the tower. Um, yeah, I can just use my X-Buster. Visually, this level is just so cool with how vertical it is. It's really exciting. Oh, almost missed that. It's 
just a methodical climb. Hey turret. Yeah, I'm away. Oh no 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 that's not what I meant. Hey. A little chameleon thing. I'm gonna call it a chameleon. Looks like a chameleon. Okay, alright, 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 alright. Methodical. Methodical. Not methodical. I don't even know if that's a word, but if it was a word, that's not the word I'm looking for. Okay, we're almost there. Okay, here's a heart tank that we should be able to get with the boomerang cutter. Once I figure out the right place to stand. There we go! Alright, so we're just missing, I think we're only missing one heart tank. So now, what could possibly be left? Well, we did. Oh, where's the sub tank? Uh. Dang it. Where's the fourth sub tank? I don't know where that is. Okay, anyway. Let's go to Sting Chameleon stage. There's a mini boss to fight who will give us a cool item, weapon, thing. C curious. Can my, can my flamethrower do anything to the scenery here? Oh, what? My flamethrower is useless. Oh, it's just because I was standing in the water, probably. I wonder, because there is a stage in Mega Man 7 where your flamethrower, fl not flamethrower, but fire weapon does damage to the environment. Um, yeah, let's go homing torpedo, and we're going to climb up here. There's a mini boss to fight, and he's tough from what I remember, which probably means I'm going to like totally trash him, but we'll see. You can only hurt him by hitting him in the head. It's the first order of business. So you have to be very methodical about how you go about fighting him. That's why I like the homing torpedoes, but even then you can't just like spam them like you can with a lot of other enemies. If he grabs you with that arm, he will he will hurt you. Nope. You wanna fire them while you're aiming towards him. So I'm not going to be able to take him out uh, before I run out of ammo, I don't think. I could be wrong. But anyway. I'm starting to wonder why I had so much trouble with this guy. Okay, so I've got him locked, locked in here, but I need to stop taking damage from him. Let's just get away. That's no fun, just locking him into one spot. Okay. Nope, you are not going to grab me with your grabber arm. I am not part of a cheap arcade game. Don't you guys hate those grabby arm games? Does anyone else hate them like I do? They're like impossible to win. Okay, so I'm getting close to beating him. Or I just got him down to half health. I'm hoping that's more than half health. <laughs> no! I'm not a prize at a grabby arm game. Stop it! Oh. Okay. One more. Now we are out of those. So now what's next? What should we use next? It says I have one, but I totally don't have one. Um. What's the R? Oh, the rolling shield. Not the flamethrower, not the chameleon sting. Shotgun ice if I had real awesome spatial awareness. We are going to go X-Buster on his butt. Just take our time. Ah, you missed. Oh, he's pulling himself now. No, that was that was a bad idea, bad idea. No, no, don't do that. Don't do that, Mega Man. No. 
Whoa! Yeah, suddenly he gets much more difficult when you don't have homing torpedoes to rely on. Sorry, horming torpedoes. I gotta say it right. I gotta say what the game says, you know? No! Oh my gosh! Stop this! Okay, he's smoking more, which means his lungs are not doing well. So he's suffering from lung cancer. That'll help us in this fight. I have no I have no sympathy for him. Aha! We beat him! Alright, cool. Now what do we get? Yes! I knew it was an armor upgrade. I think it's the armor. I do believe so. Hello, Dr. Light. Contains a new type of body armor. Yes! And this is the best body armor in the entire X series. Because it cuts all damage you take in half. Yes! It's amazing. I... Yeah, when I first played this game, when I knew that... Because I, I wasn't initially, when I first played this game, I wasn't like, Yeah, I'm totally going to get everything in the game, man. Uh, I don't know what voice that was. But uh, then I learned that there was body armor that reduces the damage you take to half. I was like, I need this because I'm not very good at this game. Uh, <laughs> so, what's next? Um, where would that next upgrade be? Um, you know what? I'm going to stop it there because I've already probably fast forwarded a lot. I didn't realize. The clock's been going for over 20 minutes. I don't know how much I've fast forwarded it and cut through. But anyway, <laughs> so these last Mega Man episodes are a little longer. That's fine. You know, we're getting to the end. So next time we are actually going to head into Sigma's Fortress. Who needs all the upgrades anyway? I've got three sub tanks. I got most of the hard containers. Yeah. So anyway, next time we'll take on Sigma's Fortress. It has multiple stages. We'll see how far we get next time. Thank you guys so much for watching. Question of the day. What is your favorite, uh, like, body gear upgrade you can get in, in a video game? So not weapons, but, like, if it's armor or if it's, you know, a shield or if it's a tool like a grappling hook or a stun weapon or something. Not a weapon. Uh, something or a scanner or whatever uh, from any game. Let me know. Mine, I... Don't know. Uh, <laughs> oh, rocks the rock's feather in Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. Freaking love that little feather. It can make you jump over everything and do a flip, and it looks awesome. I'm easy to please. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Tadpole Plays Mega Man X. Searching out upgrades next time we take on Sigma, the big ugly mug. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching, and remember to always be fantastic.